Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss out on tips, tutorials, and insights on cybersecurity and IT. Today, we're diving into a fundamental concept in networking, network topologies. Now, if you're looking to get into cybersecurity or network management, understanding network topologies is key. So, what is a network topology, and why does it matter? In simple terms, a network topology is like the blueprint of your network. It shows how all your devices and connections are laid out, whether physically or logically. Think of it like a roadmap for data flow. First up, we have the point-to-point -to -point topology. This is the simplest type, where data travels directly between two devices. It's fast and easy, but only practical for very limited setups. Think of it like a one-on-one -on -one conversation. Next is bus topology. Here, all devices are connected to a single central cable, known as the bus. Data travels along this bus, and each device listens for data meant for it. This topology is cost-effective and easy to install, but if that central cable fails, the entire network goes down, not ideal for critical systems. Then there's ring topology. Devices are connected in a circular loop, so data travels in one direction around the ring. This can reduce data collisions, but if any device in the ring fails, it can break the entire network. It's often used in small networks where this risk is manageable. Star topology is very popular. Here, each device is connected to a central hub or switch. If one device goes down, the rest of the network remains unaffected great for reliability. However, if the central hub fails, you're back to square one. Next, we have tree topology, a more complex structure that branches out in a hierarchical fashion. It's like combining multiple star networks, making it scalable and ideal for larger organizations. But it can get costly due to all the cabling and maintenance. Then there's mesh topology, a robust, fully connected network where each device can communicate with every other device directly. This provides high redundancy and reliability, but is often costly and complex to set up. It's mainly used in critical networks where uptime is essential. And finally, hybrid topology. This is a combination of two or more topologies tailored to fit the network's unique needs. Hybrid networks are flexible but can be complex to design and manage. They're often seen in enterprise environments. So there you have it. A quick overview of the most common network topologies. Each of these has a role in the world of cybersecurity and IT. Choosing the right topology depends on factors like budget, scalability, and of course the specific requirements of your network. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and share it with others looking to get into cybersecurity. Got questions? Drop them in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe for more tech and cybersecurity insights. Until next time, stay secure.